<laughs> life gives you lemongrass. Shove it in your drink. My fatness has blurred them out, Facetune style. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. Like a freaking Christmas tree. 23 degrees, people. 23 degrees. Hey, welcome back to another weekly vlog. I was a bit screechy, didn't mean to do that. I just stopped to uh, eat my tuna salad and full on panic has set in for the uh, old summer bod. And I realized kind of as I opened it, it was about to suck in, I'd forgotten my fork. So I've just had to nip to Starbucks. That wasn't good. So I've just had to nip to Starbucks um, and grab a drink. So I can also grab a fork. It is so mild today. I love it. All right, I'm gonna scoff this, pack on with some work and catch up with you later. I can't believe it is two minutes past seven and I'm still working. We haven't actually had dinner yet either. And uh, getting pretty hungry. Scott's just cutting the grass for the first time this year, which is much needed. How much cat poo did you stand in? Oh, uh, no, I've got to pee most of Oh, well done. We've had some cat sheezing in our um, garden. So Scott was playing lawn mowing roulette by cutting the grass today. Um, dinner only takes 10 minutes, so I'll just do it when you're almost done. I was talking to my uh, customers. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> and to you. What an absolutely, perfectly a beautiful day today. I put my jeans on this morning and I decided, oh god. Uh, no, I have gone for a dress for work today. And I'm so excited today because today's the day that I get to see my little brother. I haven't seen him for three years, just over three years, something like that. So after work, the plan is to then just get back and enjoy some time in the garden because 23 degrees, people, 23 degrees. Hey there, Bella. It's a little hot for you out here. Just having myself a little cool down, if you've not tried these. Um, I picked these up from Aldi. Uh, they're not very expensive, but they're a little alcoholic. Um, ice lollies. So this one's a gin and tonic and I'm pretty sure they do a Prosecco one as well. But they're really tasty. Yes, I'm in my pyjamas already. Oh, I'm really snoozy. I decided to have a bit of an early shower. I wanted to wash my hair so I didn't have to do it tomorrow before going out to work. And then I thought, it's like half past seven. What's the point of getting dressed again so I just put my PJs on and they are freshly washed off the lines and they smell delightful. I was just thinking about that uh, gin and tonic ice pop thing that I had earlier and I realised that's actually been in the freezer since last year so you know when things get like really really frozen like they've almost, in fact that may have even defrosted then frozen again, <laughs> not 100% sure but I was wondering if it got stronger with alcohol because they were 5% um, and it felt quite strong because I'm super super snoozy now. Oh, our poor money tree is not looking too good. Does anybody have any tips on poor money trees? We really cannot keep plants alive, poor little thing. I don't know how the cat's still living to be frank. <laughs> it is so beautiful again today. And I'm not sure it's as hot as it was yesterday, but I am by the coast, so maybe just the coastal towns aren't quite as warm. Had nothing for food in the fridge today, so I've made a salad, which is basically green. So it consists of salad leaves, avocado, cucumber. Um, I've got a couple of pine nuts and some pomegranate seeds in there. But that's it. I've, un I've just realised I've unintentionally gone vegetarian today. Today has just been a good day and a bad day. So good day for work, a uh, very productive day for work actually. Bad day for two reasons. First off, the air conditioning went again. It did this last year, I remember, so I need to go and get that topped up. Because the second thing that went wrong, um, I was about an hour away from home and then my dashboard on my car lit up like a freaking Christmas tree. And it went into limp home mode, which is done before. And I remember last time I did it, it cost me about 800 pounds. So we're getting over that drama by going out this evening, I say we, me, I'm going out this evening with the girls for dinner, is that Jane? I'm just going out with um, 
Jane and Louise. So I've just nipped home, got home about two minutes ago. Jane's picking me up now. I dug out this green maxi skirt which I found in the back of my wardrobe, which I haven't worn since I went to Egypt, which was probably, I don't know, five years ago? It's actually a size 10 and it's too small because you can't even see the pleats at the top. My fatness has blurred them out, facetune style. A loose white top and my shoes I've been wearing all day so my feet are probably stinky. And my new Topshop bag which I picked up. Right, I'm gonna go wait downstairs for Jane I think now. Got all my shizness, let's go. <laughs> Hello and good morning. It's Saturday now. Uh, yesterday, last night, I went out for some leaving drinks for a colleague. So that was nice. I didn't really film much. I think I might have filmed a cocktail. My goal today is to have a bit of a productive day. A few things that's annoying me about the house at the moment. Mainly these cupboards. These corner cupboards. If anybody has any corner cupboard solution, because they currently are just filled with stuff and then you can't get to the stuff at the back which is really annoying then this one is over full and then you just can't get to anything perhaps a little bit too much kitchen information for you there so my plan is to sort that out i want to get rid of all of the um uh, big jumpers in my wardrobe and get them up in the loft and get all kind of my spring stuff out because uh, i just keep getting up in the morning and i'm like i don't know what to wear and then this evening we're going out for dinner with my family because my brother's back so looking forward to that. I think we're going to go for some pizza, which I need to book the restaurant actually. I think we're going to go to Danelio's in Norwich. Um, and then tomorrow I may have accidentally invited the whole family round for a roast, um, which I'm now <laughs> regretting slightly, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Right, I'm going to get clearing out some cupboards, wardrobes, and then I must go to Adnams actually and go and get some wine before I go meet Scott after work for pizza. <sighs> Right, let's get productive. Play Geography album by Tom Mish. Are you playing it? Hey Siri, turn it up 20%. Right. It is another beautiful day in paradise. And my productive day has been pretty productive. Um, sorted out all the kitchen cupboards, sorted out my wardrobes to put all of the winter stuff up. Um, probably not the best shaped item to be eating on camera um, and put all my summer stuff into the wardrobe so wishful thinking at this weather is going to stay around for a little bit um, just having a break in the garden it's just so lovely just sitting here with our giant olive tree he's not going to stay there by the way he um, is part of our new garden plans which will hopefully be put into progress soon. I'm just gonna scoff my lolly and then what time is it actually? Ten past four. So I need to leave in about an hour so I'll just have this and then think about getting ready really. As per usual I'm running super late but always have time to run through a little outfit situation. So this is my new blouse from Topshop. It's actually quite a short blouse but uh it looks a bit longer once I've tucked it in. Oh, and now I've just made a mess of myself. Extra elastic -y waistband for the pizza. And then these little slip-on shoes. I think these were from ASOS two, maybe even three years ago. I can't remember now because I didn't have time to do my hair. So I'm going for the sleek back approach this evening. I'm really, really, really should not be vlogging as I walk down the stairs. Um, I am very much looking forward to uh, pizza tonight. Scott and I came here. Oh God, I seriously shouldn't be doing this as I'm walking down the stairs. Hold on, wait one. I'm safely on the ground. Scott and I went uh, a couple of months ago and had a really nice experience. So the pizzas were lovely. The staff were lovely, all the owners were lovely. I was looking forward to hearing about some of my brothers stories and tales from his travels. Right, let me go pick up the old uh, hubster and get our pizza on.
Do we know what that was? Yeah, that whole thing was such a Another great thing to do. I'm going to go for it. We're going for it. I'm going to go for Florence. What are you going for? Livorno. That's what I had. Oh, with the egg. You didn't have that one. We all want that boy. Good morning. I decided to have my morning cup of tea in the garden because even though the sunshine isn't quite round here yet, it's absolutely beautiful again today. I feel so snoozy. Woke up about quarter to six, I think it was, with a headache again. I just get them all the time and it is doing my head in, literally. So today I think I'm cooking a roast for mum, dad and Mark. And first of all, Scott and I are going out this morning to go and look for garden slabs. We have found some, but they're not cheap. So we're going to go and see if we can find um, a bit of an alternative. Yes, I think Scott's mum's coming over as well later on for a cuppa. So quite a nice social day today. Although Scott has got an absolute shed load of work on. We are off on our way to some home. Depot stores. We're going slab tiling. Slab tiling? Slab shopping. We're going slab shopping. Exciting adulting happening this morning. Uh, first off, Wix and then being cute. Yay. It's so nice out here again today. For some reason, I've decided to cook a roast dinner. It's one of the hottest days of the year so far. Um, and are you laughing at me? Yeah. Why? I am indeed. So I'd put some fresh mint in my drink. Pretty sure this is mint. Does this smell like mint to you? It's lemongrass. Is it? It's lemon, isn't it? Yeah. Can I put that in my drink? Mm, lemon drink, yeah. I'd like a lemon drink. <laughs> Life gives you lemongrass. Shove it in your drink. Typical, put the sun cream on and the sunshine's gone in. Family have gone, roast is done. To be fair, I was thinking that um, it was a bad idea doing a roast because of how hot it was and everyone else having barbecues, but then it's absolutely chucked it down, so feeling pretty smug actually that we had uh, a roast instead of a barbecue. Um, Scott and I are just in the orifice working. Um, I'm just going to edit this week's vlog, um, actually just get ahead of the game a little bit. Um, I'm feeling pretty full, although can't stop thinking about the fact that there's crackers and El Presidente cheese in the fridge and some wine which will be consumed later no doubt. 